Motivational Moments by Bert Oliva. Welcome back to another motivational moment. Today's motivational moment is about what you resist persists. What I'm talking about is we want positive things in our life. However, if it's not in direct proportion of what it is that you're thinking about, you will attract more negative in your life. Think about this. Have you ever had pain of some sort? The more you talk about that pain, the more that pain comes to you or something happens in order to achieve more of that pain. Does that make sense? In fact, it happens with everything. When you meet someone who says, well, you know, you're a kind of lucky person. Well, it's, is it really that they're lucky or they're attracting luck into their life? See, luck is when preparation means opportunity. The more prepared you are, the luckier you're going to be. We need to stay focused. We need to stay focused on the positive things and avoid or not give too much energy to the negative. Believe me, it works that way. It's really that simple. It's easier said than done. We have to learn how to condition ourselves into being a positive person most of the time until it becomes part of your life. Watching these videos, getting involved, going to seminars, that's just the beginning of something that you're going to need to do for the rest of your life. I just wanted to make sure that this message comes out clear. What you resist persists. Earl Nightingale said it best. He said, what we think about, we become. It all starts with a thought process. Comment. Let me know what you think. Don't forget to subscribe, repost, forward, share, like. Do all those things and whatever else you can do to help me change the lives of over 100 million people in a positive way. My name is Bert Oliva. And remember to live life and don't let life live you. I'll see you tomorrow. Stay up to date with all of Bert Oliva's motivational moments by liking his Facebook page. And be sure to follow him on Twitter.